Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today you're gonna see me clean my wood tools off. There you see a scrub brush and dishwashing liquid. It's what I use to clean my wood tools off. Um, my brush is not a hard brush. I actually got that brush from Walmart um, in a, the cleaning aisle. So you maybe can find something um, like that at Walmart or your local store. So um, I wanted to tell you guys Make sure you clean your wood tools off after every client. I do sometimes use a disinfectant wipe, but I try not to use those too much because I don't want my coat to start coming off of my wood tools. So I use this washing liquid with a soft brush, and you just want to make sure you get in between each wood tool, like the roller that you see me using now. Like you want to. That's why you want to use a brush because you want something to get in between the grooves of your wood tools. You want to make sure that you're washing them really thoroughly. Um, washing each tool down. You want to make sure that you're rinsing them thoroughly. Just make sure you rinse the soap off. You don't want the soap to dry on your wood tools. So make sure you're cleaning them after every client. Make sure you're washing them off really good and rinsing them off really good. And then you're going to make sure that you dry them. I use a paper towel, which you'll see me do in just a second. And I pat each of them down um, one by one just to make sure that no extra water is dripping. Um, and then I just let them air dry. So yes, y'all, make sure y'all wiping down each of your wood tools, at least keeping them from dripping water because you don't want them to, you know, you don't want to leave water on your wood tools. You want to dry them really good, wipe them down with something to dry with. I use a paper towel and then you're you're going to be done. That's, that's how I dry my wood tools, y'all. Wash and dry them. If you guys have any questions, leave your questions in the comment below. Thank you for watching.